I want to say Shalawam. We back with a part two. We just this is the this is the walk and talk uh, section of the video. But uh, there's your girl. Yeah, there's a lot of, there's a lot of fine ass women at the park today. That's one thing for sure. But I right, was. <laughs> So we just gonna go in the spirit. We didn't know what we were talking about. We just, this is a nice day to park. We can do a little walking. You know what I mean? What was we, we just we made a video on idols and stuff. We got a scripture or something you wanted to read? Just give me anything. Something to get us in the spirit. Baruch got six chapters. Who? Uh, not really. Well, Baruch's actually two different books. You know that? Yeah. One of them's, uh... <laughs> oh, I think it's because it's not Baruch. Because the other one's the epistle is a Jeremy. Jeremiah, ain't it? Or something like that? You know, it has, has actually two different books. What was it called? Something else? Yeah, the letters of Jeremiah. That's what it was. Because one, Baruch, I think Baruch, he was a. What is it? He worked for Jeremiah or something like that, didn't he? Yeah, I think he wrote for Jeremiah. Yeah. You gotta look that up again. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I better continue on that. Yeah, just keep going on that. We're just going to spirit. I gotta find my place. I got where. Can that. you even read it? It's bright out here. Yeah, I can read it. It's a beautiful day. It'd be more beautiful. You know what would be way more beautiful? If the corona was actually real. And motherfuckers is actually dying, like dropping. You see bitches just dropping dead. Cause you know in a real plague, you know in a real plague, you'd literally be walking over dead bodies in the streets. You know like the Black Death, that killed like two thirds of people in Europe. Sorry. Killed two thirds. Two thirds. This corona ain't killed nothing. What did it kill a bunch of old people? Not even a bunch. But how many deaths they say there was in America? Like 20,000? Yeah. That ain't nothing. It's like 340 million people. Oh. It's like that percentage is so low. It's minuscule. That's like a, a dust of sand, a, 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 a one grain of sand on the beach. Yeah. That's about, you know what I mean? But they got these people shook out. You people at the park walking around with masks. It's crazy. This shit look, look like Freddy Krueger's house. Jeremiah 25, 33, and the slant of Yahweh shall be at that day from one end of the earth even unto the other end. They say the, the slain? Yes. Yeah, Who said the slain of Yahweh? The Most High is going to be from one end of the earth to the other. God damn. Sorry. That's going to be beautiful. Hey, look right now, the slain, even though the corona, it ain't hitting like we wish it was hitting. Lord willing, maybe they say they could, they could, uh, there could be a second wave. They keep talking about the second wave. You know what I mean? So we don't know what's going to happen. Okay, but it's, it's going to be bad for these people. We know that. Because it, it, this whole lockdown thing is from one end of the earth to the other. And when the Lord going to bring that death and destruction, that's going to be one, one end of the earth to the other. It's like when he come with that fire. America's got to be destroyed. Even the land of Israel itself, it got to be burned and purified and restored. It says, uh, they shall not be limited, neither gathered nor buried. They shall be dung upon the ground. <laughs> they shall be dung of shit upon the ground. And that's how it's going to be. Like we said, in a real, in a real pandemic, or you know what I mean, there'd be dead bodies everywhere. I bet you during the Black Death, you know that during the Black Death, they thought that was the end of the world. <laughs> you would think it was the end of the world too, all them people dying. I thought World War One was the world, the war that kills all of us. Yeah, the world that ended all wars. Yep. They thought that was the end of the world. They never seen that until they seen the horror of World War Two. That topped even that. So what's the next horror? That's them thermonuclear missiles. God damn. So that's how you can, I mean, before, you can see how they aired in the past. So they thought it was at the end. But now we know we're at the end because of this technology. 
That's something that separates the times we live in from any other time. And that chip too. That micro, yeah, mark of the beast. Hey. That was never possible before. Yeah. Yeah. That's crazy, man. Yeah, shit. I tell you, what is, I gotta find that scripture. Hold up. Get that. I'm gonna get you on camera and try. <laughs> Go ahead, I gotta give you some FaceTime. says now learn a parable of the fig tree when his branches is yet tender. Like the branches. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, that's racist. It's like that. It says, it says now learn a parable of the fig tree when his branch is yet tender and put it forth leaves. You know that that summer is nigh. So likewise ye when ye shall see all these things know that it is nigh uh, near even at the doors. Oh, so that's how we can notice it's near. Even the door. You want to take a right up into the grass? Let's, let's, yeah, let's just like uh, angle away from the heathens. So go ahead, and speak on that. Oh yeah, he said, he said, you know, like the stuff, like like right now, the stuff button and stuff like that. That tells as a sign that's it's it's spring. spring. Yeah. So now you see all the different prophecies. The Lord said everything. The Lord said he was that was going to happen. It's happening. So that should be a sign to you. You can. Seen at the end of the world. Yeah, you can see that flower budding on that prophecy. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's, it's about to yield some fruit. Yes, sir. That prophecy growing up and about to yield that fruit. Look at your girl over here. What's she doing? Over here stretching and dancing. Dude, look look at this. Well, this got that nice zoom on it. Zoom action. It's got 64 times. Oh, yeah, that's what you got too. Look, that's the playground. They got a playground taped off like it's a goddamn crime scene. Yeah. <laughs> they came and let little children play on the playground. Yeah, but fuck it. Fuck your children. Fuck the kids. Fuck them. I'm with it. Yeah. Uh, uh, the scripture says the word is the seed. So then, so the Lord is bringing out that word of prophecy. We have their teaching. That's the seed. And now this button is starting to grow. So now it's going to grow to prophecy, you know what I'm saying? It's like them beautiful what is, there, some, what is there, some lilies over there? Them ain't lilies, are they? Oh, there's our lilies everywhere. Where'd they go? Oh, shit. My shit's still, uh... There's a bunch of shit out here. Like, look at this demonic shit right here. The hands. That's probably, that's, look like a, a dead person's hands coming out from under the ground or something. You know there's something satanic behind that. So I got this second edge is nine. And one he answered me then and said, Measure thou the time diligently in itself, and when thou seest part of the signs past which I have told thee before, then shalt thou understand that it is the very same time wherein the highest will begin to visit the world which you made. It's the very same time you're gonna visit the world which you made. We getting close to that. Crazy ass looking. Uh, some, look at these violets. What? Oh, this tree right, the twisted one? Yeah. That looked like the one off of Conan the Barbarian. You ever seen that tree that he was tied up to? No, anyway. That's kind of similar. That is crazy how it's twisted like that, ain't it? That's a cool little tree, though. Me and, me and him's met before. <laughs> yeah. You ever know how you get to know a tree? Yeah. People think you're crazy, bro. Sorry. That is a weird tree. Says, uh, therefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars of the people in the world, earthquakes and uh, oh, uproars of the people. I said, uh, uh, we ain't going down to the state house, but down at the state house, bro, they protesting like crazy. They out there with guns, they got rifles. You know what I'm saying? There's people, the uproars of the people. There's people protesting this lockdown in all kind of states. Oh, did you see the protests in Texas? But Texas ain't playing, son. They had thousands of people. I'm talking about, they made Columbus's protest look weak as fuck. It looked like the whole goddamn state of Texas came out and protested. And they all, they was all strapped. They was all strapped. Every last one, even, you know what I'm saying, the women was walking around with guns. There's going to be uproars of the people. We might get to the day where they start pulling people out of them, uh, out of the state houses. 
That would be beautiful, man. And we're not encouraging people to do that, by the way. Because we would never do that. Because we're not dumbasses. The violence is not the way, my son. Sorry. <laughs> is that still is the way that's the way the dark side. Yeah. We we we'll get violent when the Lord makes us violent. When the Lord gives us that power, he gives us spirit actual physical He's going to give us actual spiritual power. He's going to give us superpowers. Only then will we be violent. Because then y'all can't do nothing about it. You can't stop us anyway. You know what I mean? It's like trying to go arrest. You're going to arrest the Incredible Hawk. You're going to put cuffs on him. I'm like, come on, get in the back. That's not going to happen. You're going to get smashed. You're going to get Hawk smashed. So that's why we tell people, yeah, you're supposed to be peaceful out here. Rest the only Superman was, only weakness is kryptonite. And I remember when brother made a point, our kryptonite is sin. Yep. But when you get them new bodies, we ain't going to be sinning, so there ain't going to be no weakness. And you just through. You know what I'm saying? Through. You have no weakness. Yeah, that's true. We're going to be perfect. You're going to make us a new creature. What is that? Is that that Corinthians? you going to make us a new creature? Let's get this real quick. This real quick, guys. Uh, the second edge is two. There are 28. It says, uh, The heathen shall envy thee, but they shall be able to do nothing against thee, said the Lord. They're going to envy us. Oh, the heathen already envy Israel right now. Like, like who? Best athlete. This proves who the Israelites are. Because everybody want to be, I want to be like Mike. I want, where did that come from? Who's Mike? Oh, you know, Mike is a Hebrew name. And Jordan. Yep, and Jordan. Yep, Michael Jordan. Even Michael Jackson. The son of Jack, Jacob. <laughs> Everybody wants to be like Michael Jackson. Everybody wants to be like Michael Jordan. Everybody want to be like Tupac. Ali. Wait, they want to be like Muhammad Ali or Mike Tyson. Mayweather. Ooh, man, don't nobody like Mayweather. It's like, nah. He's my favorite. He's undefeated, though. Yeah, he's undefeated. That's what I'm saying. He's a champ. He's a champ. Well, I guess they took his belts, but he's still the champ in my eyes. It's like... <laughs> He undefeated. Right, he undefeated. Who's the only other undefeated boxer? Rock, uh, Rocky Marciano. And he's an Israelite. Even though he looks like a so-called white person. Well, he's Italian or something. He's an Israelite. Everybody, you know what I'm saying? The, the heathens, they envy Israel. They wish they had flavor and style like us and the gifts. The Lord gifted us. He said we are a special people. Uh, what what do you say? A peculiar people. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Uh, let me see. Wisdom Solomon 2. Wisdom <laughs> Solomon 2 and uh, 23. It says. Uh, let me see, hold on. Uh, let me go to 21. It says. But this goes into the wicked, their mindset, and how they're going to torture the righteous and try to kill them and shit. Uh, it says, uh, such things they did imagine and were deceived for their own wickedness have blinded them. And for the mysteries of God, they knew them not, neither hoped they for the wages of righteousness, nor discern the reward for blameless souls. They, they trying to, they going to come eventually try to come and kill us and shit. You know what I'm saying? But they don't think, they, 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 they uh, take it to thought that the Lord's going to come in and rise up for us. You know what I'm saying? It says, for God. Hey, that's the, I'm sorry, but that's the. That's that ultimate surprise right there. Yeah. Like, you dumbass, you, you, you know we the children of God, but you still going to try to kill us? That's, that's stupid. Right, because the elites know who the real Israelites are. They know who the Israelites are. So we, look, the Lord's going to stand. That's what the scripture says, that, that the heathens, they think that the Most High don't hear and he don't see. Because the scripture said, well, Psalms 50, that uh, he thought that was all together as thyself because the Lord ain't really doing nothing yet. So Esau think he cool since the Lord ain't really making his mood yet. He think he ain't doing shit. He ain't, he ain't give a fuck no more. And you probably got other Edomites, because there's some examples of this in the scriptures, who are scared. They're like, oh, no, we fuck up these Israelites too bad. We're going to get fucked up. <laughs> Remember, what was that heathen, the, uh, the general in the book of, uh, man, what was it? it uh, not uh, that too. Uh, shit. Uh, in the book of Judas. When he was like, oh, if, these, if their God is with them, if you go and you mess oh, with them, yeah. you can't defeat them. 
You know? Yeah. But it says, for God created man to be immortal, and made him to be the image of his own eternity. Nevertheless, through envy of the devil, through the envy of the devil, envy of the devil, came death into the world, and they, it, look, at, look at your boy Cain. Cain made a stupid ass sacrifice. He sacrificed fruit, because he's a goddamn fruit. And then he was jealous of Abel, because he was doing the right thing. So what did he do? He slew him. He tried, and then, and then his, I think uh, Cain's family tried to, started, uh, Try to kill uh, the rest of the uh, Adam's seed or something like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it's always been Esau versus Jacob. They always try to kill the righteous seed because he's jealous. You know. And like that shit was saying too, they had to envy the devil. You ever notice how our people, they envy the devil. When they envy because they want to be like Esau. They want to live like Esau's living. They want to get rich like Esau's rich. And then, it, I mean, that's where they get all that homosexual, transgender shit. It's really, you know, to go places in society, you got this bag of shit. So they, they have to be holding this side, so I do find it. Like I said, he just, he just, he just murders. Like, like I said, since he, since he, uh, since Adam, I mean, uh, not Adam, was not able to do the right thing. He saw us getting jealous and shit because he can't do the right. His spirit, his spirit is never right. He always want to be us. You know what I'm saying? But his, his spirit is wrong, so he can't be us. You know what I'm saying? So what do you do? Get jealous and he's trying to kill you. You know what I'm saying? Or, or, or deride you, make, make, you, make you look like a bad person. I said, get that, that John 8. Exactly, what John 8, bro? 8. See, like we was just saying, is remember, remember what I just said how our people they, they envy the devil because Cain's the devil, Esau's the devil. Okay, now, let's walk this way. I don't, don't want to walk. I was trying to. We was on a trajectory to run right into two thirds. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, that's their, their father's the devil because that's what the Lord told the Israelites that their father was the devil. And Cain, and he, who did, he said the devil was Cain, right? He was a murderer from the beginning. Who's a murderer? That proves man can be the devil. Because the devil, who's actually murdering people is humans. Cain was the murderer. He committed the first murder. Hey, read that again. That proves a man is the devil. If you are your father the devil, and the lesson your father you will do, he was a murderer from the beginning, abode not in the truth. He abode not in the truth. Like you said, what? He didn't give up the right sacrifice. You know what I'm saying? He gave up some what, some fruits and vegetables as a sacrifice. They ain't got no blood in it, bro. Ain't no sacrifice. Cause they had laws back then. He knew the law. Uh, what else was I gonna say? I, I was more to it. Go ahead. He says because there is no truth in him when he speaks. Oh, there's no lie. truth to him. He's speaking of a lie. Oh, remember? And he, then he tried to lie about uh, where Abel was at too. Yeah. Cause he's like, where's your brother Abel? And then he's like, what am I, my brother's keeper? Instead of answering the Lord and, you know, just saying he killed him. Mm -hmm. And most high is like the cry of your brother's blood has come up to me or something like that. Mm -hmm. He says, when you speak of a lie, you speak of his own. For he's a liar and the father of it. You know what I'm saying? He can't do what he, Mr. Can't, what, what, uh, can't do right, whatever. He just, he, no matter what he does, he's, he's a liar. He just, he, that's what he is. And we... Or the truth, where the complete opposite. And he wants to be a so goddamn bad, but he can't. So then, what he do? He throws a little, little fit like a little kid that he is, and he try to kill people. You know what I'm That's what he's doing right now. This, this is a, this is locked out. Is Esau throwing a fit? Yeah. Yeah. That's a, the devil knowing, but he got a short time. Mm -hmm. He throw, he trying to, he's trying to make shit happen because he, he sees shit going. His society's going down. Bro, you know they get tired of us teaching on the streets too. No, a lot of brothers can't even go out uh, downtowns and teach no more. 
Do you see anybody teaching out downtown or anything? I see Dallas still. They about to, I guess. We probably could get away with it, actually. I say fuck them. There ain't no gonna be nobody down there. Yeah. There's gonna be way more people at the park. Yeah, I think as long as you keep your distance or whatever. Because I've seen the, brother, the elders do it. And then cops pull by saying, Yeah, because when they in New York, they gotta out. wear masks and shit. Yeah. That's some faggot shit. In Dallas, too. They might do that shit in here. I don't know, I ain't wearing no goddamn mask. Like, like the elders, what's the name, Ramlai said, they, if they order that shit, you guys, you guys do it. Oh, yeah, I mean. Just to be, uh, what's it called? I mean, this is the Lord said, was that Matthew the fifth chapter? If uh, you got to agree with your enemy. Yeah. Unless he overpower you or something, or something, you know what I mean. Hey, get that script. Let's get that, because that, that's a good scripture for this time we in. That's a Matthew 5 somewhere. Towards the latter half of it or something like that. Oh, we up in the college, uh, the, uh, the amphitheater. Oh, shit, shouldn't it? Man, they, going, they done canceled the Asian Festival, didn't they? I don't know. Ain't that this time of year? Or it's next month? I don't know where. Y'all canceled the Asian Festival, bro. Y'all got hell to pay. Sorry. We ain't gonna sell them fine-ass Chinese women. Sorry. Doing their little dances. You like oh, that, yeah, bro? Yeah, yeah. That, yeah. That, that was it right, was right here. Oh, yeah, that shit was smooth. That shit was lit. Yeah. Cause remember they, they they put a uh, they had a covering on this and they had it. It was raining and shit. Everybody yeah. left. We went, we went right in the middle. Yeah, of it. yeah. That shit was hard. That shit was smooth as fuck. Damn. But uh, <laughs> yeah, but the Asian festival we lit, bro. Yeah. A lot of them motherfuckers be Jake. Oh yeah. Like we were niggas break dancing and shit. Oh, they had skill. They, yeah, I forgot about that. They was break dancing. They was to, to hip hop. It wasn't even Chinese music. Yeah. You know, talk to them too, man. oh yeah, they was cool as hell. Yeah, that, that was my uh, that's my friend's so-called like half cousin, whatever the fuck, a cousin-in-law, whatever the hell. Remember they came to camp and shit. Yeah, we talked to them for a little bit. Damn, one one dude was weirdo, but yeah, <laughs> but it was Jake's though. But uh, this is Matthew five and twenty-five. Agree with thine adversary quickly. Uh, while while thou art in the way with him, which we are, we in America we can't do nothing about that. Right. It says. Uh, at least at any time, the adversary deliver thee to the judge and the judge. Oh, yep. yep so, so if they say you got to have masks in a certain area, you're going to have to wear the fucking mask, especially if you're out teaching or something. Mm -hmm. If the cops come up and tell you the social distance, just fucking do it, I guess. Yeah. You know, because you, you don't want to, you just want to get rid of the cop as soon as you can. Yeah. Say whatever it is just to make him happy, get, him to, get the fuck out your face. Yeah, now if they tell you vaccine, that's where he's like, hell not. Nah, yeah, so, you, so at certain times you got to draw the line. Yeah. Because that's breaking the commandments right there anyway. Yeah, that's uh, you put something in your skin. Mm -hmm. You're not supposed to. got pork in it. You can't touch it. Uh, you can't touch it. Pork. And it has a abor uh, aborted fetus cells in it. They and said uh, they, they got cells from uh, aborted uh, fetus uh, lung tissue uh, cells. That's a dead body. That's unclean too. Yeah. That's an abomination. Who comes up with this shit? So who's the, who? you tell me what kind of sick fuck is extracting cells from dead fetuses? It's like, oh, I'm going to try this to see if this works. Esau. I mean, what even makes you try such a thing? Esau. That's insane. That's crazy. He's going back to this day. He can't get right. He just, he just like, bro, just leave it naturally. But he just always got to mix it up with some weird oh, shit. Oh, shit died. Oh, shit. That was good, though. That was a good one.